Yeah, matches do go by kind of fast, depending on what character you're against. It all depends on the matchup, too. And it is a little bit different than it was at the beginning, because, correct me if I'm wrong, didn't they... So at the beginning of Ultimate, uh, Magnet Hands was pretty reduced, but um, has it been at all buffed over the course of the updates? Um, honestly, I really haven't been paying attention to that. When buffs came out, when the patch notes, I just paid attention to the characters, honestly. Because... I would say, if you know your character's recovery, it's like, essentially gonna be the same, even if they reduce or buff Magna Hands. Like, you know when you'll be safe, right? Because you'll get a feel for it, so... I don't know. Seeing another Evil King here. Ganondorf's actually absurd in this game. Yes, I mean, it's like, still... I mean, so easy to kill, but still kill so easily, too. Exactly, like, he's, uh, I think Ganon's a de I think he's a good character. I don't think he's, like, busted or anything, but I just feel as, like... Once you put him in disadvantage, you just gotta keep him in disadvantage, he'll win. Yes. He's effectively, he's kind of a glass cannon. Exactly, he's super glass cannon. Like, if he touches you, he dies, but if you touch him, he dies. <laughs> but, I don't know. Uh, well, okay, so E Serpent, really, he played Ganon in Smash 4. I don't know why he's playing really in this game. I think, really, he's essentially really bad, in my opinion. The character is, like, supposed to be heavy, doesn't move like a heavy, super, super light for what heavy should be. Um, the only thing he has going for him is like multi-jumps. Because like, you can use your multi-jumps to mix up your landings and uh, keep your opponent guessing on when you're gonna land on stage. I mean, I've heard some people compare Ridley to Charizard. I don't, ooh! Got, got the F-Smash, nice yeah. read. He just read that he was throwing out a forward air and he just got F-Smash for it. Okay, he's in there. Okay, he read the air dodge, that's good. But. And, and that kill was in under 30 seconds. Yeah, Ganon hits hard. Just wizard kicks in neutral, okay. And a shield, side B. He's gonna read option. Uh, no, he rolled in. And then the, the point blank side B is always a nice mix up. <laughs> oh, he read oh. the neutral get up, but he missed time to up smash. Okay, I don't think he wanted to. He attack. He tilt canceled his nair. I don't think he wanted to do that. Okay, he's gonna edge guard him here. Right? Throw out. And the, the, the sliding on from Ridley. That's the side B, right? Yeah, side B. And that move is so frustrating when it hits. I hate it. Oh, that's good. That's good spacing. He read that he was going to just side beam. Just went back and hit it. But um, E Serpent, when he's at ledge, as guarding Ganon, he can't stay too close to ledge because Little Man will just like upbeat and like it'll go through the stage, the hitbox, and just swipe him away. So he needs to stay at a comfortable range to where he can react to what Little uh, Man's going to do at ledge. But he's bringing this back. Yes. And of course, another reason he can't be too close to the ledge when Ganon's recovering is even though this isn't some S4, so long as the stocks are. Are, you're, as long as you're up a stock, um, Ganon's side is still a thing. Yeah, exactly. It's still a thing, though, but I mean, you can mash out of it, and it also it kills Ganon first in this game. So. But was that was that back air or forward air for the win? For the wing? Or for, for the well, where, uh, where where Ganon took out E Serpent just then? I wasn't seeing, but what, Ganon back air? Ganon back air is just like he turns around and like he punches. Okay. Yep. Forward air, he like leaps forward. Yep. Uh, I, I know what those two look like. I, it just happened so fast. Okay. I think it was back in there. But we're back to even here. Oh, in we this went match. Far up here. Okay. All right, see, I like what E Serpent's doing. E Serpent's realizing that Little Man's throwing out a lot of options, so he's abusing the platforms to get around because, like I said, Ridley has multiple jumps, so it's like he's going to keep him guessing on where he's going to land. Yeah, like That's Little really Man good. trying to be aggressive, but it's almost. But E Serpent has kind of gotten the, the rhythm down, figured out how the little man is moving. Oh, I read the spot dodge. It's not going to be it, though. He doesn't have his jump. He should have capitalized on that. Hey, e Serpent doing he needs a good to go job. Of, he's okay, see, like I said, that was a smart out. Did he grab? No punish. <laughs> ah! Okay, good back here. Wow. All right, just just shoot your. He, exact, thank you. That's exactly what he needs to do. Just like that. When he realizes that he too far out to like jump in and just go directly under from the stage just run out in there because he's too far away he's gonna eventually have to jump so it's like there before he jumps yeah just once Ganon was off stage e serpent was just doing what he could to keep him off there mm -hmm. exactly I mean with with characters that are heavier and um, have more trouble with their recovery that's kind of the way you do it mm -hmm. not the Ganon as you said isn't someone risky to do that against but clearly e serpent seems he, he seems to know how to handle it yeah, Ganon's recovery is really linear, so it's like you'll be—you'll know—you should know when you're able to punish him off stage. All right, little man. I think you should take him to a smaller stage so he doesn't, or like, or FD, and not give E Serpent that much room to run around or platforms to abuse. Because um, 
And like I said, Ridley's really good at abusing jumps to get on platforms and just mixing up his landings and everything like that. So it's like, it's really hard to keep Ridley in the juggle situation at higher percents. Looks like we might be going to Yoshi's Island here. Oh, he's just gonna town. run it back. He's just gonna run it back. They should get rid of both Yoshis, in my opinion. The perfect stage list, in my opinion, would be the starters would be Stadium, FD, Town, Smash, Battlefield, and then counter picks would be just Kalos, and you get two bands, no DSR. Perfect. No slants, no bull crap. <laughs> yeah, but I think we're I think we're all just happy to, to not be back to the days of four of four five stages. Yeah, but you mean you only got one band too, so it's like it's a little different. You have uh, six stages and two bands. But that's neither here nor there because we're not having that. But good edge guard doesn't have a jump. Oh, just and he, oh, he did oh. have a jump. Wow, he saved that. I thought he got hit out of it. So okay. E Serpent continuing the strategy of keeping the little man off the stage. See, exact. At that point, he should just run off in there because that's exactly how he took the game last time. Okay, he ride the option, but he just missed face up smash. He's producing a lot of, of tilts and dares in this game. Oh, that's a good angle on side on up B. It really is really weird because he's um he can angle his up B, but he can only do it in four directions. The king only like left, right, up, down. He can't do like all parts of the Oh! Uh, oh. oh! So stage spike and then uh, little man or Easterman tries to recover but he goes straight oh, he just up. Read his yeah, exactly. That's ex um, that's what happens on Smashville in town. If you um, if you don't angle it right and you try to glide up on the stage, you'll just get pineapple. Or you uh, yeah, get by the stage, however you want to say it. All right. Uh, he's gonna land on the platforms. He should have noticed that. He's seen him drifting towards it. Oh my God! The spot dodge cancels. Good spacing. Good spacing. Yes. Seems he seems Ridley's four smash has decent reach. Mhm. Mm Ooh, nice, oh, nice, his uh, F smash is really good. It has barely any lag. Nair him. Ah! No, he's gonna die. He put himself. <laughs> yeah, he put himself wow. in disadvantage there. He went too low. Okay. I couldn't even tell what, what happened there. Was that. He just got down aired. Because he went off stage and he naired and missed. And he was like really low below the stage. And so. Little man was hanging out on ledge. Like, he's just gonna have to directly up so I'm just gonna trade with down air. I, I love how these guys are having the retaliatory kill right after, right after they just got killed. Yeah, they're keeping it close. Keeping it close. Right, we're on the last stock here, and it's only been a minute. Oh, yeah, he overcommitted with that jump. Okay, so, uh, East Serpent's F smashed him so many. Just near him. Oh. oh, yep. Oh. Okay, he was sent the wrong way, though, but. Had the right idea. Exactly. East Serpent is like. He's reading all of Little Man's spot dodges, and that's like essentially what's putting Little Man in disadvantage, too. Huh? Technical difficulties. I'd sit. Uh oh. Man, we can't connect to internet in this room. Well, I mean, it's not. We're not connected to internet. Well, problem is. What's it? Runes. Did they call my round two yet? Uh, I don't want to get DQ'd. <laughs> Liz! I'm going to see if I have to play my round two real quick. Technical difficulties with the, um, with the stream switch. It says that we need to connect to the internet. Probably means some, something to do with the something to do with, with the DLC. Sometimes if it if it thinks you're not if you don't sometimes if it's not connected for a long enough period, it's not sure if you're actually allowed to have the DLC in the game.
All right, we are coming back. Uh, I have to wonder what happened there. Okay, so going back to the oh, and there's the end of it. It might be easy to try and blame that particular loss on the loss of the rhythm, but get uh, but a uh, little man already his percentage was already quite high.